Hey guys, and welcome to 314 Gaming, and I am Momo, back here with Life is Strange, and yes, it's here. Episode 3 is finally here. I mean, I kind of expected it to be this long. I mean, they have, to re they have to make each episode every time. But I, man, I hate waiting. There's just such a good story going on right now, and I'm very excited to play this right now. Now, first thing I'm unfortunately gonna do is I'm gonna take the music volume down just cuz I'm uh, getting uh, uh, copyright issues with YouTube because the songs they play in the game I know it's gonna take down all the other music as well I wish there's a, a different way of like making sure that the songs played or something so unfortunately all of our experiences are going to be a little bit hindered. So, with that said, let's go ahead and get episode 3 started. And if you guys don't remember what happened in episode 2, I recommend going and watching it. If you have a uh, uh, recap yourself, I'm going to try to recap myself as I'm going along. I, I remember a few things. Like, I remember Kate being up on the roof and she was. Uh, and jump off, and we were able to save her. And it's also really funny as I watched in the other YouTubers' uh, videos of this game. A lot of them didn't save her. I've only seen, I've only watched the ones I've watched. I've only seen one other person actually be able to save Kate from keep her from jumping. And I'm actually interested to see how it affects the story from here on out. Like we really haven't seen too much of the consequences or like choices or scenarios where they can. Uh, have a really big impact, but like if she's not even like a, a major character rest in the next three episodes, then what was the fucking point, am I right? So I'm hoping like she's still relevant, like she's still a character that has a lot going on. Like if she would have died, obviously she wouldn't be here and couldn't change in the uh, events later on. But since she's alive and still with us, I'm hoping that she still has like a big role to play in the story. And also, I did watch the trailer, and it looks like we're going to get a whole lot more into what's actually going on here. Like, the last two have been just kind of, like, dicking around, trying to figure out our powers, and, like, we know something that's coming. But there's oh, obviously a lot more going on, and I, we're really getting seem, it seems like we're going to get to the bottom of that in this episode, which is what I'm really hoping we do. So... Let's go ahead and get started. I guess we're going to start back in our dorm like we did in episode 2. So yeah, I, I really hope the music, you guys can live with that. I know I'm going to go back and... In the previous oh, episode, yeah, try. We get a is strange. Previous thing. Just like any other TV show or movie. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Stop saying hella. Hate that word. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey. Stelma and Louise, you're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody I do. What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Alrighty, so we got a recap. I was actually trying, like, trying to figure out everybody's name from this game, and I completely forgot Friendzone's name, the guy right there, and I was right. His name is Warren. And I think Asshole's name 
I think it's Nathan. I know Bitch's name is Victoria, and our friend's name is Chloe. I think I have those right. Nathan, I'm not too sure on. So, is this the same night? I'm thinking that's what it is. Because the last couple of times they start like in a new day, but it seems like we're starting off that night. Like after Kate had, uh, was on the roof. So I'm guessing we're in the same night. We're going to bust in and find some shit. And I can't tell if it's just me right now, but I think my game might be a little glitchy right now. I'm hoping it's not too big of a problem. And I'm hoping all the recording and audio stuff is going right. Because I'm going to be really pissed if it isn't. Life is Strange, Episode 3, Chaos Theory. Life always finds a way. Why is my... I have a, a rabbit? I have a rabbit? Since when? Kate! We saved her. Okay. That was that noise. That ass. I knew Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. Is that a coyote? Are there coyotes? God damn it, really? Really phone? Shit. Okay. Um. What? I can't water you. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. Yeah, who gets two shits? Are you a hungry bunny? Here, not on Since this. Since when did I have a fucking rabbit? Seriously. His name Bugs. His name better be Bug Bunny. Turn on. Flap on. Flap off. I guess I can't play You know you're hurting when you don't give a shit about music. Oh. Really? We're that hurting? Alright. Is there anything... Nobody messes with me, bitch. Oh, I'm pretty sure Victoria left that. No way can I clean that shit off. Time to get Samuel Da Vinci to repaint. You just call him Da Vinci, really? But, uh... There's been so much going on, I almost forgot about the eclipse. I didn't forget about it. All this atmospheric action can't be a coincidence. And all roads are leading to my tornado vision. Alright, let's go. This is a... Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... A flashlight? This is like a horror game. Something's gonna pop out on the walls. Wait, why is there tape? Oh, this is cage room. Okay. Uh, fuck that. So much hypocrite. I'm the one who fucking saved her. But none of y'all bitches can say that. Well, actually, I know. So there is no button. What up, uh, Dana? Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. Um, let's just go with that. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Do, 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 do. Maybe we can ask her. So why do you think she was on the roof in the first place? Maybe Kate was so ashamed she got wasted on that video. I don't blame her, but it was pretty gross. Come on, you really believe that Kate Marsh wanted to get drunk at a Vortex Club party? So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan uh, It was expelled? Nathan. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? 
Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Oh, me. Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Why you lie? You just lied. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Wait, that look Going through her things. shit. I knew something new now? I don't... There was nothing important there. Whatever. I'm outy. Let's bounce! So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Yeah? Is there anyone else around here? Why are you being all buggy right now, gang? Guards to my school during the summer. So if you're wondering why there's a jump cut there, Wait. Maybe it's me. Who that? I heard something. It wasn't my dog just coming down the stairs. I heard someone talking. I heard some rustling. Is this different? No, I think that's the same. Can I run? I can run. Ah! Wells. Oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Are you drunk? You sound drunk. Um, is there like a way to sneak around? Is there a way to go around? I wouldn't know. Oh, the most magical insects. Burn bright. No, wait. How can I take a picture? No. Okay, escape. Sorry, sorry. I guess I can go this way. The Tabanka does look pretty scary at night. Please don't destroy me. Um, I, I got a message from Chloe. I have something to show you. Yeah, okay, Chloe. Thanks. Alright, this is a new message. Keep your smart mouth shut about every or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. Hey, Horf. Seven eyes will be exterminated. Watch out. I don't... Alright, this is it. This is from tonight. So well, that's new. It's probably... It's probably from Nathan. Um, uh... I wish you could scroll. Alright, so this is... Alright, this is from the last game. This is probably new. Yo, yo, Max, you had to remind... Just had to remind you again how fucking awesome you were today with Kate on the roof. I'll make... Make ah uh, god I can't read why. I'll make you a superhero suit on the labs 3D printer. Cool, and you totally earned dinner on me along with our escape to a planet O oh, apes. Call me. Thanks, Warren. I need to rest my cape tonight. Nathan got suspended too, so it was a good day. I'll call you later. Okay. So good. Nathan did get suspended for good. I was actually worried that the asshole would find a way. Alright, so these, this is new. Max, please call us as soon as you can. We are so proud of you for saving this girl, and we want to know how you are. So please get in touch. We love you. Sorry, Mom. I'll call you back in a few minutes. Swear. Thanks for letting me gush over our Blackwell hero. I miss your voice. Very proud, so milk this moment. Let us know if you want to come up for a quick getaway. Okay? We love you, Maxine. It's actually kind of cool if we could do that in the game. Um... Why are you broken? God, this is really hard right now. Maybe Samuel should fix that lamp. Thanks. So, how do I sneak around this asshole? Is there like a... Alright, I guess since we have the ability to rewind, we might as well... Miss Caulfield, you have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. Uh, I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still tense after I thought Kate was going to jump today. I just needed some air and space to walk. No, no explanations. Seeing Kate come up on that roof, then seeing her come down with you. You 
saved her ass. <sighs> Maybe saved Blackwell. Now don't get cocky. Going back inside. You earned good dreams. So great. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Yeah, how do I do that? This thing do a thing. Something to do a thing. Can I oh wait. Sure. Hopefully Samuel left this open. Yeah, I can go inside and like shut down the power or something. Oh, it's unlocked. I hope Samuel isn't around. I'm sure he isn't. Hey, look. Fox. Nothing here. Oh, well, I mean, there's something. I want it. Go get it. Nuts and bolts. <laughs> like my grandpa's garage. Is this a thing? That's not a thing. Hey, a scarf. Or s stuff. I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves. So, who does? Why the hell is there shit in here? Well, I can't go in that room. Well, there has to be something in here. You look like a, a box. This looks like something important. Oh, wait, that's the water thing. Uh, I've got a nudie magazine. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? Um, uh, alright, there had to be a reason to come in here. Why can't this door just open? Um, there had to be a reason to be in there. Hey, squirrel! Squirrel! Oh, the squirrel's so badass, you just... Uh, control, right? No? Oh, shit. I don't know, I'm just gonna rewind. Maybe... Oh. Oh, God, I am so stupid. Um, I wish, like, why isn't this going like that? Maybe whenever he's, like, just blabbering right there. I, I've been holding shift, but you don't go any faster. Yeah, okay. Maybe while he, like, his back is turned. Keep your back turned, buddy. I don't know why I didn't think of this before. I was trying to be way more stealthier about this. Max the Ninja strikes again. Yeah! Yeah, we did it. We did it, did it, I did it. We did it, 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 we did it. So, where's Chloe? Oh, ah! Yeah. Fuck you! Get it? Boo, yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk ass. Agreed. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. <sighs> Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Fuck NATO. Chaos Theory? Didn't you say that it was all about Chaos Theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. 
Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Um, I'm gonna say about Rachel because I know that's what Chloe cares about, and I know she we need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody, even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... I'm going to say alive. Alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck? That light anymore? just went out. We're in it to win it, Max. Right. Why do I want to sell that? I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Wow. Could you be any more lame? Like, seriously. Stop being so fucking lame, guys. So much hey, who the fuck is that? Oh, it's Nathan. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow you. Oh, no. Shit. Sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Fuck you, Victoria. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... I really hope Mr. Jefferson isn't doing something stupid fucking right now. Me. Fucking Victoria. So stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. All right, this is it, guys. We're going into the school, and we're going to find out what the fuck's going on here. Chloe the Keymaster. You know That's I... a gay-ass name, too. Stop saying stupid shit, people. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for... But you stole the serious. fucking key. We you do not jail. have the authorization Not if I'm related for. to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. I agree. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers mad didn't Max. save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Who would even be here this late? I wonder if... Uh. That's it. What's it? Oop. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. I don't know why. He's hiding shit. 
like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. Well, I'm pretty sure the key is actually what we need because because the game wouldn't just allow me to allow you to. Uh, Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. Make it that easy, game, would you? No. Why would there even be a key around here? Desolation. Do -do -do -do. Squirrels like nuts. Does that mean Samuel is? Nah. What? The fuck was that? Nothing to see here. Is there pornos in there? <sighs> no keys here. Well, I could have told you that. I feel like I'm looking, looking the drawers, you know? Something that would actually store the key. Because I could have told you that already. Wait. Is this something? Are you a thing? Look in this drawer. Crap. Then I guess look in that drawer. Boring. You're boring, Max. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. What? Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Yeah. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the help. You ain't your shit, Chloe. Keep it to yourself. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? My plan was to blow some shit up. I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. Oh, yeah? The race is on. See you soon. Challenge accepted! Oh, really? Do, 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 do. Do. Sodium color, what the fuck? It's just a powder used to create chlorine dioxide. Shit, everybody knows that. So are you really going to try this? Keyword is try. I bow to your wisdom. Thanks. What do I need? Um, but, uh, but, all right, I need sugar, soda can, duct tape, and sodium chlorate. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. You okay if I run? I think it's okay if I run. This is the sign. Wait. Kate's locker. So glad you still have your locker, Kate. Oh. Okay, we can have something. Have some. Can I get in here? Man, now I find some secrets about Mr. Jeffrey. This is like a scene in a horror film. Uh, except there's no crazy killer or un uh, announced demon, something. Oh, Kate, even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Yeah, it's a good thing I saved her. Victoria, that is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? It's a picture of a guy. Who gets Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. Who, who is this? I don't know who you are. You're nobody to me. Why is that so awesome? Cigarette pack? Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. We sure those Victoria's? What other Mr. Jefferson's? That would also be kind of weird. Any other things I can snoop? Oh, I can take the... The tape is mine. Oh. So I had to come in here. That's good to know. Only three more items to go. That's good to know. Glad I came in here then. Oh, look, more duct tape. 
Do 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 do. Ba dum bum ba da da. Do 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 do. Wait, is that it? All right, get out of here. Move on to the next room. Can I go this way now? Is this? Dang it, it's not open. I already know all about the missing people. Yeah, that does, uh, I was just thinking, like, I remember at the very end of episode two, they had, they showed, like, those You're an artist, David, book. not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Oh, well, good. I can't read the fucking labels. Thanks for making me sound so stupid for thinking that I could be. Stupid Max, making me feel so bad. They look a science book. So, sodium chlorate is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Factoid? Stop talking, Max. Please. But anyways, I can't remember if they had shown Rachel's, uh, little binder thing that... Like, we saw Kate's no, little binder. this mixture doth not work. Well, I don't know, Max. You don't have to be so mean about it. Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Let's do it. Good evening, fish fish. Thanks, fish. Nice work. Busted. Please resume your slumber. Alright, so we did that. Good for us. Now, where the hell is, like, a sugar... Oh, sugar. Hi, sugar. How you doing? Okay, I can't... Stop. There we go. Ooh, sugar. Yummy. Get our sugar high on. You're halfway home, Mac. An A-? minus. Alright, alright. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. You say so. You still there? Did you blow up, Max? Still here, didn't blow up. Not yet. I need to concentrate now. Talk to you later. Yeah, Warren, stop bugging me. Alright, so I need a soda can and some shot uh sodium crap. I never said they were great, troll. Wait, what did that other thing said? I had I sex never said they with were your great, mom. Troll. Oh! That's so clever. You guys are so clever. Wait, I saw something else, didn't I? Or am I crazy? I think I'm crazy. Where the hell is this sodium crap? Huh? Oh. Good thing? Here's the sodium chloride box. Yeah, so how do I get it? That's so funny. That's so funny. Cigarettes kill. Kill that thing. So, I move this chair over. Can I? Here's oh. the sodium chloride box. Oh, well, take it. I know we're gonna knock something. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Finally, she's fucking learning. Yay! She actually knew not to be an idiot. Okay. Only one more ingredient left. You need the soda can, which. Could literally be anywhere. I think. I mean, I would. You would think to look in a fucking trash can. Wait. Mm -hmm. Ass biology. Ugh, gross. It's the anus. I probably should find those items now. Well, yeah, we should. We we got three of the four. It's not like we've been doing nothing. Alright, where would a soda can be? If I was a soda can, where would I go? How about here? How about in the vending machine? Release the crack can. Oh my god, Max, you and your terrible one liners. It's all mine anyway. Ah, oh, Max. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Literally. Sorta. Of. First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. You will end them. Okay, Chloe. 
You've had all fucking night to do this, and you can't do shit. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! I mean... If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. <laughs> Thought does. That was so fucking cool. Oh. oh, we are toast. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. No, 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 no. Uh, so what should we do? Let's go in the room, and then we'll be rewind. Yeah. Come here, Chloe. Chloe. Yeah, I'm not there anymore. Oh wait, you're kind of fucked. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with her rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. So fucking awesome. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money. But no taste. That's you. I mean, I agree. Huh, ah, crap. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be a black one. Yeah, what the hell does a bronze Amy. bird have to do with anything? I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. I would, but no. That's probably really dirty. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. Well, yeah. It's what the money pays for. Those things are this fucking is your nice. To truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock? Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan, anybody. What are those binders I'm on I the saw? Case. There are some really, uh, student files. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Until now. Like I'm not going to read my own personal file. Update. Despite some recent conversations with Blackwood Security, Max showed herself to represent the very best of Blackwood Academy by stepping, stopping fellow student Kate Marsh from jumping off. Ah, what? I'm so awesome. That's what's this file up. is going to be so spotless, a projectile vomit. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Yeah, sure. You know he would. Only two more files to go. Oh yeah, you yeah, got five. Tumbleweeds. Oh wait, this is one of the brick books, isn't it? No, it's not. So Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully too. Shocker. All right, Principal Wells. In light of the recent outrageous outrageous allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel that my large contributions to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. <laughs> of course, the situation can be. Uh, Rectified once Nathan is reinstated at Blackwell with a written apology. Along with that, I understand that the tragic event involving Miss March gives you a pause, but I would suggest that canceling Thursday's party is not conductive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. Thank you, Sean Prescott. I think he's he could possibly be someone who sent a letter to or a message to me. That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. I'm so awesome. I'm so awesome. I don't think these are. Wowzer, this will so not come in handy. It could to help your, help you make you smarter, give you an education. I don't think there's anything in there. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. Okay, but there's not much here about the police the investigation. Side. Uh, uh, blah, blah. Oh wait, there's still more. Damn it. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Oh, man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Huh? Bad Chloe. Oh, that wasn't what I needed. 
Right, so there's still a couple of things over here. Maybe. Oh wait, here's Kate's. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the Ooh, wrong place. Update. At present time, there is security investigation into a controversial video allegedly featuring uh, Kate Marsh at a Vortex Club party. That has been uploaded onto the internet without her knowledge or alleged consent, along with her claim to be taken to the hospital during the party, so... See the attached files for the complete details. Do 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 do. Uh, do 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 do. Okay, that's cool. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Yeah, because Chloe's doing so much help. Max? You better come check out these files. Oh, maybe she is actually helping. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott III. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I already knew that. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa. Listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Yeah, Or kinda. did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This will chill him out after you almost, you know, shot him. Yeah, that was a regret. I wish I hadn't done that, actually. Are you going to make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Really, game? You got to give me this option. All right. All right. Moral says, leave the money. I mean, yeah, we're gonna have to leave the money. That's just stupid. Why the fuck would I steal the money? Because that means they're gonna know someone was in here, and we're trying to like cover our steps here, people. It would just be really stupid unless somehow I could figure out a way to frame someone else for it, besides Chloe. So no, I ain't fucking. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but <sighs> I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. I mean, it's let's also probably not really the handicap fun. It's probably some stupid money that's just covering up utter crap. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. But we need to cover our tracks. The last thing we want is someone... That impish look scares me. Yeah, it does. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let Don't me take my money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. We hella deserve Stop saying hella. Splish Splash. Uh Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. No, you're a terrible, terrible influence on her. Never say hella. Don't say that word. I mean, South Park did an episode so long ago about not saying that word that that should already be, not be a thing anymore. I mean, come on. 
Stop saying that word. This is how we get in trouble. I know it. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls' night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Yeah, we should. Boys or girls? That really a thing we're doing right now? I mean, I'm a boy. I know that. Like, what's going to be the ultimate consequence? I kind of want to go to the boys' locker room just because of, of humor's sake. And I want to see what happens. Because, like, if you go to the girls' room, it's probably nothing's going to happen. Boys, of course. Uh -huh. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Whatever. I don't care. I mean, does it really matter? Hey, look. Another soda can. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. Yeah. Hey, it's Logan's locker. I guess I should consider this evolution. I can't read that. Dana, I know I'm an asshole, but I still care about you. Love, Logan. I don't know if I know that in this game, because I know I had to redo the first episode, and there was a couple things I did differently. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? Can I take them? I want to take them so I can't have them. Screw that douche. Oh, look, knee sick. Some poor hipster lost their vape. I'm sorry, but the vapes aren't a hipster thing. At least in, in my opinion. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. But why? He loves you! Dumbass! Being so sidetracked over here. I was talking something else and then that thing changed what I was talking about. So, yeah. I don't think vapes are really a no hipster thing. No way am thing. I touching Zach's jersey. I think it's more of a douche thing. I mean, like, at least from my own perspective. This all I fucking see are douchebags doing the vapes. That's all I ever see. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Oh, look, graffiti. No worries. It's all bad. Sometimes. Sucks me up. Oh. Boys' locker room is right. Victoria loves the D. Well, I mean. Huh, it's nice to know Victoria loves something besides herself. I mean, is it really. What the fuck? Welcome to 1950. Right? I mean, after the Nazis? I love Warren. Gay Ram? I bet you do. Weird. So weird. Why is that there? Dana needs a baby daddy. Oh, that's so mean. Um. Max Caulfield, moral avenger. Or self-righteous hypocrite. I don't know. You did fucking save Kate, which is pretty boss. 69 re reasons to bang Rachel. Hope Chloe doesn't see that. What are you doing, Chloe? Being a weirdo. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. Why is there like 200 different mascots at this school? Oh, look. Shark. Just when I thought it was safe to go back in the water. Yeah, because that shark's really going to bite you. Alright, where the hell's the light switch? Where's the light switch? Where's the light switch? Oh, yeah. Jesus Christ. I get so sidetracked in this fucking game. I'm like a squirrel. Squirrel! You're like, why the hell do they have so many different mascots? There's. The otters, and then there's also the Bigfoots, and I'm pretty sure the baseball team has their own team name, too. Something really stupid. I don't get this school. Oh, great. Now I'm trapped. Trapped in here forever. Where the hell are the lights at? Wouldn't they be over here somewhere? Wait, is this where I came? No, that's the girls' locker room. Oh, look, an oxygen kit. There has to be a control panel for the lights around yeah, here. Yeah, right here, dum dum. Oh, bright. Oh, 
Ooh la la. Why do you have a swimsuit with you, Chloe? Were you just were you planning on doing this the whole time? Coffee and swimming. Good combo. I mean it is. <whistles> Look at that ass. Time to do or dive, Max. Do I get to make a decision? I mean eh. okay. stop moving, Chloe. Chloe, stop moving. There you go. Oh yeah, baby. Feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie. Okay, you asked for it. I am. Cowabunga! Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. Why? It's awesome. <laughs> Splish splash. Splish splash. I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. Because I know you I can know fix anything. I mean. You're becoming like... This force of nature. More like luck of nature. She's the reason why fuck needle comes, Come on, isn't it? My power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Thank God. But what if I had? What if Kate didn't jump, but you would be dead? So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Maybe, I don't know. Time stuff is weird. I don't know. Well, I do, okay? So just listen to Captain Chloe. I'm trying, as long as we don't waste this power. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is... nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friends zone. Called it. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. I mean, he has ass but kicked, but okay. I haven't told him about my rewind power. Oh, I did. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. I mean, that's what happens. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other. Otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's jet. Let's call it a draw. I'm going to freeze my ass off when I get out. Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Bum bum. Hi. Bum. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Where the hell's Chloe at? Move, Max. Don't waste your power on getting busted. I'm trying. Make sure you cover the whole perimeter. <laughs> Shit. What up, David? Nobody in here. Go look somewhere. Fucking. 
Dude, hide. Like when we were kids. Oh, yeah. I could use my power. Or just look for a hiding spot. Or both. Where are they? Hello? Nobody here. I'm so screwed. Where you at? Hey! Get your ass back there. Back up. Back the fuck up, boy. Okay. Bad idea. Bad idea. Where are they? Shh. Hello? Hey, camera? Something so wanky right now. I need your help. I totally boss this thing. Hello? Anybody there? I don't know. Where the fuck are you, dude? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Did you? Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Ah! Hey! Shit, I am so fucked now. That was not the plan at all. Fuck! What? I wonder how we'll get around this. I'm trying to figure it out. Don't try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. I'm scared, bro. Where's he at? Oh, do I just boss that? Okay, now what? Where the fuck is Chloe at? How'd he get in here? Oh, I went the wrong way. Fuck you! You're so invisible! Yes, please. That was actually kind of nerve-wracking. Totally bossed that, though. Wait! Turn around! They're coming! We have to find another way out! Damn it! Oh, this is bullshit! Where's your truck at, Chloe? How the hell did you, you get- You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Uh, what? You crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? Uh, okay. Into the car. Get in. <laughs> Later, fuckers. Max, you rock. We are so fucking awesome. <laughs> yes, we so are. Um, okay, sure. That just happened. The half painted house. That was gonna happen now. So now we are on Wednesday, am I correct? Oh my god, they slept in the same bed. That's so hot. Just kidding. That weird. Well, you say you can, did. What's going on? Did 
take a selfie. Always remember this moment. Always take a selfie. Photo bomb. Photo hog. So cute. Oh, so cute. Look at that ass. Look at them asses. It feels like a different world from yesterday. This we really is a different Mark world. Mark on last night. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? Maybe. I very well could. I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. Oh yeah? Gonna yeah, pay in the room. In this moment of silence. I'm so wiped out from last night. But it was awesome. I have to ponder what kind of criminal I've become. Last night was to only be a criminal, you iceberg. had to be caught. I have to admit, it was pretty cool to take over the Blackwell gym. Today the gym, tomorrow the world. We need to step it up. Yeah. We still have to be careful how I use my power. I don't want to get stuck in time. Another moment of silence, please. I wonder if there's supposed to be music playing right now, and since I turned it off, I can't hear it. That would probably that's probably what the scenario is right now. Supposed to be relaxing and enjoying the music, but I can't because of copyright issues. Thank you. I'll just make my own music then. You can talk? Is there something? Oh. Should've fucking told me I would've pushed it a whole lot longer ago. Fucking game. Alright, where's my- Okay, I need to get dressed now. Let's just wear some of her clothes. I don't think I'll be washing today. Yeah. Stop wearing your stupid gear shirts all the damn time. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Man, if I had stayed hidden, David wouldn't be targeting me. Maybe. We don't know that for sure. Ooh, your wallet. The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel's is so touching. Ew. I'm, I'm so glad I didn't. I'm so glad I got to look at that now. Alright, where else my clothes? Ugh, still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. Is this your fashion hole? Because I already looked in here. I don't think I'll be moshing today. Yeah. But what other fucking clothes do you have? I thought Chloe might put up a pic of holy shit balls. Frank is scary. I should have let Chloe take that money. Eh. Why do you have that just sitting out Frank there? Frank might think twice about messing with Chloe now, but if David finds out, shit story. Where is your fashion hole? Uh huh. Uh huh. Where is this amazing fashion hole? Maybe, maybe closet. Okay. Time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. 
She's your size. But she got but bigger not boobs. Quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. No, our style is deer you shirts. Can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. Yeah. <laughs> what game, really? Uh. No. No. Sorry, not that easy. Oh, like I am? Just admit that you already macked on me, then used your rewind. Now I can text Warren that you're saving yourself all for him. I am so going to best unfriend you for that. I love that Chloe is so fearless. But stupid. That's just dumb. Who gives two fucks? No fuck shall be given. This is actually really weird. Really not her style. Not looking sick, no. Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka Bra. No, stop talking like Maybe that. Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? This is really not your style, Chloe or Max. But I do like the change. Really was getting sick of the deer shirts. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. Oh hey, it's Kate. Max, thank you from my heart for reaching out to me on the roof. You're the only one who was there for me at school. The only one who truly cared. I have to believe you are sent to give me hopes. You did so much more than that. My father is grateful as well. You'll always be in our prayers. Love and blessings, your friend Kate. Hey Kate, I'm so glad you're okay. I will visit you as soon as I can, I promise. <sighs> It's like when we were kids here. Let's go get some breakfast. Get some hash browns and bacon, some eggs, mm. biscuits and gravy, some good old country cooking right now. Maybe a beer. Yeah. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh, I mean Max. Who would you start That was fucking weird. Fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. I pick eggs and bacon. Hell yeah, eggs and bacon. Get some good old country cooking eggs and right bacon now. All the way. But give me some pancakes when you too. You guys would sleep in until I yelled out, "Wakey, wakey, eggs and bacon!" Totally. We'd wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. Okay, I'm gonna I gotta go grocery the shopping now. And the bacon. I can handle eggs and bacon. Can we? I should evolve and become a vegan, but... Oh, bacon. Bacon's fucking amazing. Wait, where are the eggs at? Why won't there be eggs in the refrigerator? Oh, hey, newspaper. Oh, man. I don't want to be famous for this. What? Flash, no, I freak it. Flash, apocalypse now or soon. I thought that was David sitting out there for a second. Who drinks beer this early around here? Me. What happens when you live in the real world? You gotta drink. Uh, where the fuck are the eggs at? Seriously. Wowza. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Can I just give you the bacon and the eggs? Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. Where the fuck you keep your eggs at, woman? Bacon's going bad now. The ba Is there eggs in this? Okay, no. Oh, jeez. Can you help me get this bird out of here? No, bird stays in the house. Bird was gonna die. Glad I. Oh. 
Yeah, okay, just leave the fucking groceries there instead of putting them away like a normal person. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Well, yeah, because they, they go cold quick. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. Do you know what happened? I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but we are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Huh, maybe I get some intel. Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. I'll tell you, made scramble eggs. Of you and I Chloe. Did. Rachel wasn't. No, you got to make them. You got fried them eggs, not scramble them. Friend. Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? No, not really. Oh. I mean, no way he's gonna sound like I really am, but no. What? Uh, no way. I know I was selfish when I left. I'm glad Chloe found a better friend. No, just a different one. Last time I saw you and Chloe in your pirate outfits, I knew she would never find a better friend. And when you took the rap for that joint, you proved it. Thanks. I wish I was stayed like hidden. Chloe and me were pirates a thousand years ago. And that makes me what? A century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> Go sit at the table. David better not fucking show up. Ooh, peanut butter. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. But first, you scramble so damn much, eggs, guys. and you I'm don't like this chunk, table. chunky Good. peanut you butter. Clean. Max, you're weird. Can I have some of that milk? I want the milk. Okay, I milk now. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Nope. Right, I'm, I'm done. Oh, man. I don't want to be famous for this. No one knows who the fuck you are. All right, I'm done. All right, leave. There's something else. Oh. Seeing you again. Ah, right. oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Why are you with him? Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Dears. That's what. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, what I have? It was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this and... And... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? No. It's not always about you. Chloe, please, it's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. 
Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about. I thought you'd not hear that. so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. No one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure. Run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. Chloe, shut the fuck up. God damn. So whiny. I do need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. You're to try this, remember? You don't know the password. No shit it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Oh shit. Oh, it's Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. I don't think stepdad's gonna work. Why the fuck would he give two shits? Oh, shit, Paul. Shit. Find something that actually would work. What is this? Oh, padlock. Naturally, David would buy a heavy. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. 7171. 7171. 7171. 7171. Magic 8-Ball says no. Oh shit. No way, Max. Oh. You totally froze the laptop. Gotta go back in time now. Gotta go back in time. Gotta go back in time. What about this padlock? There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. Yeah, that's true. What about his, like, military ID? Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. That would make the most sense. Well, not his Blackwell one. What about his military ID? Do I have that? And isn't that something I saw once? No. I could try the license number for the password. Oh, that'd be dumb, too. What about his book? Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Do -do -do. Dave. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Doubt it. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around Honk. with this Just on the Just married. Car. Oh, oh. What about their like their wedding date? That be a thing. Joyce might as well have wrote "Let's get married." That might be a useful password. What? Why? Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Uh. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. Military personnel are some of the best people ever. Ooh. Oh, yeah. David has been dragging his head around since 2001? Good for him. Um, what's in here? Oh, yeah, it's all his... Nothing to see here. Yeah, I know. I already know what was in there. All right. We got some interesting passwords to use. Army, keep your wings up. Such wrong. Oh, that would be a good one. 63567. <sighs> Try again. Really? No way, Max. Yeah, I know. Ba -ba -ba. Gotta go back. Gotta go back. Gotta go back, back, back. Alright. Personal. I doubt this is it. Worst hacker ever. No. What that? Really? Nope. No way, oh, I Max. Know. Oh, I know. I know. I know. I know. Gotta go back. Gotta go back. 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 Gotta go back. Gotta go back. No. Okay. Stop. There you go. Uh, family. Score. Max the hacker strikes. He's only been a hacker once. Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. 
But why does David care? I don't know. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. Yeah, douche. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Am I done here? I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. Can I go back to where the computer was locked? Whoa. Oh, God damn it. Spoiler alert. Fuck it. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But why does David care? Ooh, Taylor? Yeah, a message from Taylor. Hey, Max, just wanted to thank you for actually giving a shit about me and my mom. We all saw how much you cared about Kate when no one else did. Thanks, Sarah. I know you care, too. If you're going to have to the party, I'd love to style you up if you want. If I do go, I would love to get a Taylor makeover. Talk soon. Oh, yeah, that's right. I helped out. I talked to Taylor and made nice nice with her. Boo. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Yeah, it's such an epic Do you know for sure gimmick. it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody, like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not. Now, Chloe. You used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Why the fuck would I side with David? Why is that a fucking option, game? No, fuck <laughs> that. Fuck that douche. Fuck him so hard. Fuck him. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David! You better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I oh, fuck you. I oh, fuck you. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Why the fuck would she hate you? Fuck that guy. Fuck him in the asshole. Yeah, David, suck on that, bitch. I don't want to see <laughs> or hear I'm you running away. Again, fuck you. Max. You've hurt me and my family. Enough. Fuck you, David. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Why the fuck would you yell that? I go. I'm ready to leave. This was actually quite. Disturbing. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? 
What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything. For his sake. The fuck is he eating? Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted he sometimes forgets to lock it. And eat crap. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Actually, I don't know. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. I don't know this. What do I do? Oh yeah, this is from Daddy. Maxine, pop here. I'm sorry I haven't gotten to touch sooner. I know your mom is very proud of you for saving that girl, as am I. We have no doubt seeing you to Blackwell was the best thing you ever demanded we do. It makes us so proud to read about you in the news and see actual video of you walking down from the roof with that girl. And if you want to come back home now to relax and maybe go to a high school around here, the door is wide open. Love, Pop. Thank you. Thanks, Pop. It's been a whirlwind here. I'm not ready to come home yet. Talk to you later. So, like, am I in a high school thing? Oh. Alright, let's go in. Good lord. Bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Ugh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. Um. That didn't work. But it was funny. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans! <laughs> what now, bitch? Faster, please. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Fuck you. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Wait, Nathan's here? Oh, you little fucker. What? Can I do bullshit on him, too? Please tell me yes. Please tell me yes. No. I want to spill shit on him. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Your sugar daddy will always protect you and threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Maybe because you're Maybe a Maybe I douche. can help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face. <sighs> Holy shit, what do you want now? 
I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Oh, yeah. There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky and right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Boo, boo, boo. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. Nathan, Nathan shut the fuck up. Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell with Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. Now, to his credit, he had a revelation. And he saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? What now? Go with Frank? Let the dog fights? Oh. What the fuck now? You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. And what are you gonna Give do about it? Give me my keys now! Sit your ass down, punk ass. Go faster. Go faster. Go faster. I'm pressing shift. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Hey Frank, suck on that. Someone gonna throw something at her. Yep. Are you shitting me? Why? Why must you always get shit on? Are you sh God damn it, Alyssa, can't you do something on your own? Alyssa, watch out! Quick thinking, Max. Bitch. It's all sick of taking care of you. Um, Chloe, what are you doing? I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. Um. On your mark, get set. Throw! Oh, shit. <laughs> no, go into the parking lot. I think we just made that dog our bitch. I don't want the get dog it. to get now hit by a car. Keys, but let's not waste time. Do I get the doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Yeah, so we're gonna be quick about it. I'm not getting the dog hit by a car. That's just fucking mean, okay? But you don't want to be whining like. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. Dodge the dog. Get You're not a creepy drug dealer. 
I mean, Frank has issues, but he's dealer. not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. Oh, yeah. And you dare me to drive it like you dared me to kiss you? Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. Yeah, just... I know. Just, just stay there. Me. Look around while I do all the real work. Uh, I think anything's gonna be here. You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is... Is Frank going to deal online now? Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Yeah, but can we take a picture of it and, like, maybe date her? That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Weirdo. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. I get the right tool. But this one, this one is going to open. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. I have a blowtorch. Just torch it right off. What the knife? This is almost as good as a set of keys. Really? I mean, we could stab him if he comes in here. Oh, so we only... Curses! Nothing here. Get one. Grab one. Nothing here. Yuck. Crappy Wi Fi here. God damn it. Yuck. My blade will open any portal. Jackpot. Oh man. Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Uh, disturbed sounds about right. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. Ew. Weird. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. How about sexy time? Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Well, we got this now. So let's rewind so that thing's closed. All right, I think we got our intel. Ew. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years, my mother gloms on a stepfucker, now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Oh, well, that's great. Jesus Christ, Chloe. Hey, Frank, just get back to your beans. Don't you worry about nothing. Nothing for you to see here. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. I mean, you could take up some fucking responsibility. Grow the fuck up. Grow up? God, you're not the only one in Arcadia Bay with problems. Kate Marsh almost... Yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? 
that doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked up life. Get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here, alive, with me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. God, such a bitch, Chloe. Seriously. Don't do anything stupid. Okay, Chloe. Be back later. Oh my god. The fuck? What is happening now? Is this another new power? Wait, 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 wait. What? The actual fuck. Are we gonna go into the picture? Focus. With A and D keys, then with left mouse. What? What am I supposed to be doing here? Losing! Focus! Wait. Wait. What do I do? Had it. Get a close up of that. Don't get home. The fuck? Holy shit. Someday dad'll get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah, I just, uh, yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe, give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Oh, actual fuck. Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. Oh, William cool. is here. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that what far back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crimps. I'm 18 years like old inside my 13 year old self. If you want to eat. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. I knew, like, they'd talk about you could affect the past. Mom said it depends. But I wasn't, like, sure That's they would. That's true. This was so actually gonna be a eggs? thing. Don't you like dare this much. The chef. Right. Like, you're the real cook here. Oh, because this is actually pretty cool. Oh, this game I just got so much work. better. I'll let her know that. Um. Uh, now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. Oh, it's so cool. This is so cool. I love William like he was in my own family. I won't let him die today. Are we gonna do that? I won't. Is that a thing gonna be a thing? No, don't answer that phone. 
Bitch, you don't answer that fucking phone. No. Hello. What do you think about it? I told you hey, not honey. to do it. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. Whoa. It's all blurry here. Like I can't step out of the photographic bounds. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Oh, God, no. Love you. I got it. Like, I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. Yeah, well, you're just bad for them that too. Someday. Oh. Shit, where are my keys? Oh. That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Oh, uh, where's the keys at? I gotta find the keys. What? Why would they? They should be in there, right? Wouldn't that be where they were? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. Oh, going back, bud. I know where your keys are. Get your ass back on that phone. I'll just take Score. those. Hello. Hey, honey. Wait, can I just hide keys in other places? With Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? That's a bad place. Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Can't find him now, can you, William? Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You are ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Nope. No keys for you. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! What? Really? I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, no! You'll be here too, right? She's never leaving! No! 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 Us. No! No! William, get your ass back here right now! I'm keeping the keys on me. Well, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I'm keeping the keys on me. Cause maybe I can like tell him. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for I us to feast what happens. on. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are I like, my run keys? Away. That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Let's just leave. We had the keys. We'll take the keys out Whoa. of existence. It's all blurry yeah, here. I like I can't step out of the photographic bounds. Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. No, oh, can't have him. Max, this is not the best time for a prank. Keys, please. No. Uh, I was just. Um, are you sure Joyce is ready? Uh, let's just, let's just wait. I, uh, sorry. No. I'll get you back someday. No, just stop. Don't go yet. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous. No. What do I do? I don't. What do I do? Shit, where are the keys? I need to hide the keys or William won't hear his dumb beeper. Oh. You're... So somewhere that's like gonna muffle it. That makes sense. Thank you, Max. You're actually helpful under the couch. Would be a good... Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Don't tell me you like you. put it under the book. That would be super stupid. 
Excuse me, ladies. I have to what if I, uh, queen at the save start a movie? Oh, yeah. I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. You'll be grateful for what if I, like, play a game? Make it really loud. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar! You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Oh! What if I put it in the refrigerator? I don't think wherever I hit it isn't gonna is gonna work. Shit, where are those right keys? By him. Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. I knew this. Oh, clo no! Get your ass back here. I ain't giving up. Pick you up. Uh, no. now, what if I just toss him in the fire? Be there shortly. Love you. Oh, he's gonna hear it from there. <gasps> Excuse me. Hell oh, yeah! I Throw the keys out the fucking window. The she don't have many bags of delicious I'm a genius. This is took me forever. You'll be grateful for that. Yeah, I did it. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. God, you're just as bad as us. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh, yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes, and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and joys and groceries, and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Holy shit, that, that happened. Play someone that actually worked. I mean, yes. That. Yes. Oh. That's so cool. Oh, this is so cool. Oh no. Knowing how shit works. Something bad is still gonna happen. So, yeah, how is this going to change? Why would they take a picture of that? That's just disturbing. Fuck. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. wet and cold every day. But Never like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so I know, sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke a peace pipe? No. I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Oh. Well. Well. Oh, no. Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe. This is really fucking weird. Ah, you're just a bus driver, bitch. Suck on that. It's the only good thing that came out of this. What the fuck, though? Like, literally, what the actual fuck is going on now? How much have we fucked up? I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be music playing right now, but since I have it turned off, you're not going to hear it. What the hell? Birds are acting fucking crazy still, though. This 
this is really bizarre. I'm oh, sorry, like, there's no audio for you guys, or either even for me right now. It's just what I had to do, but this is so weird. The fuck? Hey, it's a big whale. It's washed up. Can we get some audio now? Like, what the hell? There's three of them. I'm actually really weirded out by there's no music. Hey, the house is all blue. I need dialogue plays, but reassure me that the thing hasn't broken yet. Please, audio, dialogue. Can't hear the door knocking, why? Max oh, Caulfield, God. taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. What's going on? Chloe, you have a visitor. She's not all blue hair, is she? What the fuck? Holy shit. Oh, okay, game. Holy fuck. Fuck. Holy crap. Oh my god, this is why I love this game so much. I... Holy shit. That was fucking intense. Oh. Like, so much is fucked up right now. Holy crap. Oh, good job, guys. I, I give you guys applause for this amazing story right now. Like, I know, like, in the beginning, like, the very first episode, like, they say you can change things in the past. I wasn't sure how that was going to play as much as just, like, little things throughout the story. But this is big. That. Oh. So honestly, shit is still going on because we saw the three fucking whales washed up. So I'm wondering if, uh, I'm assuming we still have our powers. Without a doubt, but fucking Chloe was in a wheelchair. Clearly paralyzed. Oh, fuck. Game. Good fucking job. It was, it was a really interesting now. Now I can't wait for episode four to come out. And be even more fucking amazing. But hold. Oh, man. This just got really interesting. Like, super cool. Super, super cool, guys. So these are the songs that we would we missed. Again, really sorry about that, guys, but I don't even see anything on here that I like. Like, no one I like. Don't care. This is gonna be interesting. This is 
I really want to see what happens next. Out of doubt, I... It's going to be hard to wait for the next game. The next episode. So I'm definitely going to trim out that beginning stuff where we weren't sure how to get past Principal Wells. But I really did think like there was going to be so much more about like finding out uh, what the school knew. And what they just did, they, they added the new power to go back in time and change all that. And you just see so much change from that one thing. I mean, it's big, obviously, monumentally huge. Woo! This just got really good. So, I'm going to wait to see how some of the other people made different decisions. Look at how, like, uh, how other people just made their decisions on the certain things. And there's something I missed, too. Pretty sure. Woo! A lot is going to happen. Alrighty. Um, this is... Wait, what? That's weird. How would this change? Alright, so based on world stats, I would look at my friend stats, but I'm the only one of my friends who plays this game. But yeah, so it looks like most... Like, a little bit more... Got, uh... They left the money, just barely. I'm surprised, actually, at like, how much. There's no stat there, but a lot more people fucking kiss Chloe. That's funny. I wonder, I, I won't get this. This one, how Chloe has David's gun, or Frank has David's gun. Is there, like, a difference between, like, if you shot him or not, who had the gun, or... No. Oh. But most people... Most people kept uh, uh, Frank's dog from harm, which I knew if I could do into the street, I said that dog would get hurt or killed, and no, I don't do that. Dogs are awesome. Yeah, most people, of course, of course sided with Chloe. I'm surprised it's not even 100%. Here's the other ones that we've done. Alright, and then, what did I miss? Most people did kill the planet, I guess. Like she said, she like, drowned it. I didn't help warn with this exam. I didn't know I could help him, I thought I did whenever I, uh... He got a fucking A-, minus. he doesn't need any more help. I am on the Vortex party list, which is awesome, because I want to be there and... You erased some names from the Vortex Club list. You didn't change the names. Again, I didn't know I could do that, but I don't think I would. You erased the cop's uh, answer phone message. I didn't know. Again, I didn't know the thing. Next time, I have fucking help her. Every episode, that bitch just needs some kind of help. You didn't warn the homeless woman. But what? You took a photo in the past. I did that, which... Almost 50-50. You left a mark on the fireplace. So I wonder if these little things is changed stuff, or if it's actually just like... Um... Little things. They're just little. They don't really matter, but it's cool to have it done. Or not done. Now uh, this is I was probably going to play out bigger. Alright, so... That was Life is Strange Episode 3. Chaos Theory. And it is getting fucking chaotic. <sighs> As the great Ian Malcolm once said, life finds a way. I don't really know how that plays out here, other than William's still alive. I kind of, I, I honestly, like, kind of thought that was going to be a thing we could do in the game. But I wasn't sure how much, or like, how we were going to do it, or if they really would let us do that. Because... I didn't know how much the past was going to play. So honestly, there's probably going to be a moment in the next episode where we're going to go back in time, and maybe that's even like a choice we can have. Like, it's obviously saving William did change a whole lot. Like, I really 
Like, that's a hard choice, because, like, William's still alive, Chloe's still happy, but she's in a fucking wheelchair, definitely paralyzed. Ah, uh, this game. It really does hit in the feels. It really does. And again, we didn't get to see Kate play out much. I really hope she's, like, irrelevant since we saved her. But that is how this episode ended, and this is where I'm going to end until the next episode comes out. And I believe they're looking at a July release. I would assume another two months, like, from the, between the last two we've been seeing so far. So yeah, that's the end of this episode. And as always, I will be back in another. Thank you, and bye-bye.